Well, hello. Come right on in. You're it, Father Fish. Nice to have you with us. And Jay Lee, and he is asking, I've been breeding a couple of angels, and they're producing like crazy. I've moved the wrigglers and put them in the 10-gallon with an internal airflow foam filtration and feed like brine shrimp. They're all thriving. It's all question mark. And then down below, he says, how do I sell them? Or what do I do? <laughs> I love it. Good morning. Well, that's a big question, of course. <laughs> we'll, we'll give you a, we'll turn you blue for that one, Jay Lee. Nice to have you with us. And nice to, you know, it, it's nice to have the problem. Um, one of the ways that a lot of breeders deal with this issue is by joining the local club. Uh, and, and Because all of the clubs have auctions or at least trades. So you can take excess fish in and trade them out or auction them off for, for something else. Um, fish stores generally with angels, local fish stores love to get local angels because they're just going to be healthier and and more stable than what they can get through the industry so you might do that you might check with local stores set up some friends with fish tanks you know get a little get a little group going get a little group of friends going um you can certainly list things here and offer to ship them they that may be beyond your uh, uh, your capability or interest in shipping them out, but that's certainly a solution as well. Right. Um, oh. You might consider controlling population at some point. <laughs> but good job, Jay Lee. Nice to have the problem. Well, I hope you found something you've never seen before. Have a great day. Nice to have you with us. Come on back.